Dave! Doc Hallen's been killed. Doc Hallen? What happened? It's over at his place. You gotta come now. Oh, wait a minute, Steve. Tell us what happened. Well, I'm trying to tell you. Now, this thing had killed the Doc. Well, what was it? Stop with it, kid. Well, it's kind of like a... It's kind of like a mass that keeps getting bigger and bigger. It... <laughs> Every one of you watching this screen, look out, because soon, very soon, the most horrifying... Listen, you take it easy around here. It's just a quiet town. I know people I do business with them. Well, all right. But listen, Mr. Court, if you happen to see... Yeah, I know. I see anything suspicious like a horse with an SS brand, I'll come get you. Here. Here's a buck. Buy yourself some candy. Two million six hundred thousand dollars in cash. Whose head are you after? Yours. Mine. Yours. <laughs> mm. Let's play something else. Go. Blood starts spilling in San Francisco. They hand bullet the mud. Now, what went wrong, Lieutenant? Who else knew where he was? What? Who else knew where he was? What have you been implying? Oh, well, they knew where to look for him and they used your name to get in. Are you suggesting I disclosed his whereabouts? Well, you believe what you want. You work your side of the street. <laughs> essence is speed. The objective is winning. And the danger is dying. Le Mans, for hour by hour. My room is here, in the back. If they make a push, we're dead. I can imagine what's gonna happen to us when those crowds discover there ain't nobody over here but us campfire girls. The company pulled out last night. Be gone a day, maybe two. Race against time as one tiny spark becomes a night of blazing suspense. The towering inferno. It's out of control coming your way. Warner Brothers and 20th Century Fox present Irwin Allen's production of The Towering Inferno. The greatest adventure of escape ever filmed. Steve McQueen, Dustin Hoffman, Papillon. Keep me alive until we land in Guiana. And I'll underwrite any escape you care to arrange. Everything is left to chance. Men and women will gamble on anything. 25 and 20. That's right. The rules. He's got him. He's got him. He's $3,000. Do you act where you are? Women are a universal problem. Can't live with them and can't live without them. Prosperity for everybody. Gut money. There's no limit. No fix. It's that Three River Gambling Man, the Cincinnati Kid. The Cincinnati Kid. The Cincinnati Kid. 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 Cincinnati Kid
I want it tight for it'll burn. Look out, McCoy. Get your axe and come on up here and catch in. Oh man, that's just a game. I don't like this game anymore. Okay. What did I tell you? This isn't that game? It's all a game. <laughs> This is Willie. Hi. You've driven before, but Gino? Well, not exactly. He's all right, John. When were you inside? What? Time. How much time have you done? Look, I said he was all right. Well, I've never been to prison, sir. But are you some kind of college boy? No. <laughs> What's the letter? It's just a letter. What is this, anyway? You've been on a job before. No, sir. Nice going. Two days' notice. What do you want? I don't Take like going out with somebody I don't... 250? 250? Yeah. You're crazy. You ought to be locked up. You, too. 250 guys just walking down the road just like that. These were the men. Hiltz, the cooler king who broke every rule as fast as the Germans made them. Hendley, the scrounger. He'd come up with a baby elephant if the men needed him. Hey, you blow it off! Turn the water off! Hey, you Where's your kit? This is it. The rest was confiscated in the last shakedown. The goons didn't appreciate some of my more personal items. Such as? Bartlett 